Susan B. Anthony, Her Fight for Equal Rights by Monica Curling, illustrated by Mikey Plensky. Today, girls can grow up to be anything they want. They can be rocket scientists, race car drivers, or even the president. In the early 1800s, women did not have the same rights as men. They could not own land. Married women could not keep the money they earned. Black women had the fewest rights of all. Most black women were enslaved. Women could not change the laws to make life better. They could not vote. Many brave women fought for this right. Susan B. Anthony may have fought the hardest. Susan ba Brownell Anthony was born on February 15, 1820 in Adams, Massachusetts. She loved school. She was eager to learn. Susan's teacher would not teach her long division. Girls don't need to know that, he said. So Susan's father took his children out of the school. They would learn at home. Susan grew up to be a teacher, but she was paid far less than a man doing the same job. It's not fair, she said. Susan quit teaching. She gave her heart to fight for human rights. She worked with the Underground Railroad. This group helped enslaved people escape to freedom. Susan wanted to use her voice for change. But at one meeting, the women were told to listen and learn. Susan was angry. I am a citizen too. Susan met Elizabeth Caddy Stanton. Elizabeth was fighting for women's rights too. They joined forces. Elizabeth had to stay at home with her children. She 
she wrote speeches that Susan gave to crowds across America. In November 1873, Susan did something daring. She voted in the election for president. Susan had told women across America to vote too. Many of them did. She wrote to Elizabeth, I have gone and done it. Susan was arrested and put on trial. The judge said Susan must pay a fine. I will not pay one dollar, replied Susan, and she never did. Susan B. Anthony fought for women's rights for over 50 years. Failure is impossible. Susan died in 1906, but Susan was sure that one day women would be allowed to vote. She was right. The law changed in 1920. Her fight was worth it.